Well, the first and foremost thing, we need to rethink single cloud dependencies, which we've been preaching on this channel since this channel was around, and certainly I've been preaching for the last 10 years, you know, and talking about cloud computing and the use of cloud computing uh, to the most optimized benefit for your enterprise. So enterprises must reconsider the heavy reliance on single hyperscalers like AWS. The outage, I think, was a wake-up call. And so even the biggest platforms have vulnerabilities, uh, and you really should put your eggs in many different baskets. So multi-cloud, hybrid cloud strategies, uh, you know, should be considered, obviously, and they should have, should have been considered for a long period of time. I think the future of cloud is going to be heterogeneity, you know, different cloud providers, and certainly, you know, uh, not necessarily the hyperscalers, but looking at the neo clouds, the AI-based clouds, you know, folks like Core, Coreweave and Lambda Lab, Sovereign Clouds. Uh, co-location providers, managed service providers, which will provide you with better business continuity. Because if there is a single outage uh, with AWS or any of the other hyperscalers, um, they can isolate that pretty quick and get to some sort of redundancy um, failover capability where you're not necessarily going to be as impacted as we saw this week. And unfortunately, I think people haven't done that. Obviously, it's more expensive uh, and you have to put some more thinking around it. Uh, but at the end of the day, you should get to cloud services that are going to be um, less costly. Uh, certainly the Neo clouds, AI clouds, you know, versus some of the hyperscalers out there and provide just as good of service and also provide some resiliency options because you're not necessarily placing all your eggs in a single basket. And that's what burned people this week.